What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Ari. Welcome back to AM Island Vibes. Thank you for tuning into another reaction video. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you guys are doing pleasant. Hope you guys woke up with a beautiful smile like I did. Ding. And yeah, your boy, catch a fresh cut. Catch a fresh cut. I gotta, I, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, you know? Show the fresh cut. The beard coming in nice to be the fresh cut. Ah! You know? Uh, Y'all was doing me a little too bad. So I say, you know what? Let me go and cut just to make it better. But I hope you guys are having an awesome day. Nevertheless, all the love and support has been doing good. Oh, sorry. Hold on. Let me just, yeah. Yeah, I hope you guys are having an awesome day. All of that good stuff. So, yeah. Today we're going to be reacting to Gunna. Um, what you call this day? Gunna. What kind? Oh, Gunna's 10 Things He Can't Live Without GQ Edition. The reason why I, I, it made me think about like, what do you mean you can't live without it? You, I'm pretty sure before you got money, you couldn't afford a Gucci bag. Well, I think you couldn't afford it, but you know what I mean? Some stuff like, mmm, they should probably change the title of the show. But it's cool, you know, I understand what they're trying to do for marketing purposes, you know what I mean? But nevertheless, if you're new to the channel, smash the like button, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. Drop a comment down below, and yeah, let's get into the video. Hey, what's up? You cute? It's Young Gunner, and I'm about to get into my ten essentials. My first essential will be my custom-made Bible. Wow. A Bible is an essential of my life, and this happened to be one of my favorite. Right? The ones that I've watched so far, I respect this. This is the first, well, what I've, I've watched, like I say, what if I watched? This is the first one I saw do this. Thumbs up, Gunner. Yeah. Gunner. My best friend mother made it for me, so she's like my second mom. She gave it to me for Christmas. It has my artist name on it, and it's very special to me. When I might be, like, going through something, I kind of just read it, and I kind of, like, just let, like, things find me. And I just read it and just kind of relax and kind of ease me. I always was, like... Came up from like a home of God where we always prayed. We didn't have to go to church every Sunday, but we, we knew to have a relationship with God. My mom made sure that it would just follow me as I just wrote like every other day, you know, just pray and keep your relationship with God. My next essential would have to be this Louis Vuitton blanket. Feel that? Feel that? <laughs> yeah. Soft. I travel a lot, so instead of using like the plain covers, I like to write my own, like, like to be comfy. So when I'm on the road, this would make me think about home when I got this on. It's another one right here, Hermes, the ancient side. I love, I love blankets. I think it's just something that stuck with me, like just having blankets. I also had a blanket growing up. It was a little blue blanket. It had Spider-Man on it. I don't know what happened to my Spider-Man blanket. I think I might have grew out of it. You know, I had to probably replace it. I love blankets. The cozy vibes. <laughs> my next essential would have to be this picture right here. It's a picture of me and my mom when I first bought a house. It makes me think about one of the biggest purchases I ever made. And I got a chance to share that with her. We hardly ever took pictures. Now we take a lot. And it's like one of the very first like pictures that we like posted on the Instagram and stuff like that. So it's just a picture that I cherish and I just have to have. Every day it be on my screen, so it means a lot to me. My next essential would have to be my hard drive. It's very, very special and I'm very, very protective over this. I have the regular drive with it like a case over it. And I also have another case that sits in because I'm just very protective of this. A lot of hit, a lot of fight on that. What? I, know, I'm just going to, I got a backup drive too, so I ain't crazy, but I got to have my drive. It's one of my most essentials. My next essential would have to be my bags. I'm a bag collector. I keep bags. I love bags. I'm going to buy the bag. I feel like I got to keep a bag because I keep all like the rest of my essentials in there too. Also like my day-to-day -day stuff I have to carry with me, just like necessity, you know what I'm saying? As you can see, this is a chrome art bag. Very rare. I bought it at Vegas. It's a Vegas edition. Chrome hearts. Cost a bag. I cherish it. I like bags. I keep watches. Keep a few watches. Question. Um, and this is the other dude. But what they mean when rappers mean, get me a bag. 
How much is that? Does it, is, it, is it like a set? I know it means money, right? But is it like a set amount when they say, I'm going to get me a bag? Or they just want a bag full of money? Never say how big is the bag. It can be a sandwich bag. It can be a garbage bag. If there's a specified amount on a bag, let me know. Because he said he just spent a bag for a bag. I don't know how much it is. Which is enough just the day to day just to go with the outfits. I got a white Scott Dweller with the gas in it. I got a cardio watch. I been bought. This one of my first watches I bought for this with a blue face. I still have it. I'm not letting go. This is another watch plain Jane. My management bought this for me. I cherish this awesome. Another essential condoms. I got a low I've been using having six. But yeah, it's one of my essentials though, because we all need protection. Practice safe sex. I, I advise it. It's mandatory with me. It, you know what I'm saying? Keep you keep you a few. Staying safe is an essential. Next essential would have to be smart money. Some you just gotta have, you know, just like tens and twenties and thirties and forties. It usually be a hundred bucks, but I've been spending. Uh, this is it's like 30000 maybe a little over thirty. I barely use cash, but I like to keep it just in case it's just emergency cash to have on you at all times. Major purchases, like big like big purchases, I use my card. I pay my taxes. <laughs> and they good when you're paying taxes when you use your card. I feel like it's better to have cash in case your friends or family need a few dollars, you know. You got cash for them. Play with it. You can shuffle it. I like, I like to shuffle the money. <laughs> My next essential will have to be my car keys. Oh my God, I got a few car keys on me. I don't tend to bring all of them out. But this is four keys. I got five cars, six cars. The Lamborghini Urus, the 2020 Steam Ray Carvette, the Cadillac CTSD, Cadillac Bulletproof Truck, Hellcat Charger, though, the Hellcat Charger. Yeah, that's it. First time I started liking cars, it would have had to be like maybe. Back in the days, I was growing up. They had the Chargers, the Daytona Chargers. The Boosie had one back in the day. He used to ride on DUBs, floaters. It was like, oh, I gotta buy a car. They gotta be that car. My very first car was a Honda Accord. It was like a 1993, the same same year I was born. It caught on fire. I'm just driving. I had my I had my foot in the pedal. The pedal was to the floor, and shit it caught on fire. I had a girl in the car with me. I was embarrassed. I don't miss that car one bit. I don't miss it. I don't miss that car at all. I got five cars, but I'm, I'm a long way from that A hundred percent. So that's a wrap. I go by the name of Ghana, and that was my 10 essentials. I appreciate you. I appreciate you, Q, coming through. Let me show you my 10 essentials. Shout out to all my fans. That's nice. Check out one right now. It's out. You know what I'm saying? Come through anytime. That's nice. Okay. That's dope. Pretty decent of him. You know, I enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed the videos too. But I enjoy it. You know, it makes sense having emergency cash on standby, which is the wise thing to do. Like for people who live in the U.S. who have credit, that's good something to build to build to have like business. But where I'm from, we don't do it like that. It's different for how we do it. You know, like you guys can. Get uh, what is it? Uh, like can't get a phone um, without credit. We don't need that yo. Basically, it, it, it's a long process. But nevertheless, hope you guys enjoyed the video. That's gonna ten everyday centers. I think that was yeah for GQ. If you guys are new to the channel, my name is Ari. Thank you for watching the video. Smash the like button, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. And yeah, until we meet again, remember the world is yours. Peace.